Yo, guys. Oster? Aster? Oster? Ast? Black Clover? Oh, wait. No. <laughs> it's just the new Toa album. Oster. Aster. I don't. I still don't know which one it is. But uh, it came out about a week ago. A week ago. We, we don't say that anymore. <laughs> it actually... One, two, three, four, five, six. It actually... Wait, no. Six... It, five. It came out five days ago. Yeah, so far... I have heard Anamone, uh, Rime, San Vitalia, and uh, Twilight. So, I will not be reacting to those. But if you guys want to check out my reactions to those, either look them up, go to my channel, or look at the playlist, which will not only show up at the end of the video, but it's on my page if you go to playlists. My Toa playlist, or even the Hololife playlist, all four of those should be there. And you can check out those. But we're going to be skipping over those because uh, 43 minutes, not a long album. But it's already kind of later in the day. Not really. It's 6 p.m. But I want to react to other stuff. And I want to have some free time before I got to go to sleep, man. I got a job. So it means I got to wake up early in the morning, which means I got to go to sleep. It means I got to sleep. And I want to have free time in my day. So we're going to skip over the songs I've already heard. Uh, let's start off with the present day. Very excited. And yeah. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, let's make this full screen. And then move me over here. And now we can start it. Alrighty. Oh, 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 well, let me pause it. Uh, okay, beautiful intro. I didn't realize I was going to go into a rock, like, thing already. Present day, I was kind of assuming with that intro was going to be some crazy, like, emotional intro. It still can be. I just didn't expect the to hear that uh, uh, so early kick in to overdrive with the bass. Ooh. Make sure shuffle is off. Okay, uh, I think, wait, hold on. Is it leading into the hook? Because I thought that was the hook, and I was like, she's singing kind of lower in, or softer than I thought she would with still some, some aggression, but not as much as I thought it would be into it. But then it made sense when the instrumental mellowed out for a second there, but I think it was actually leading into the real hook. That might have been the pre-hook, I'm not sure. Like here, I was like, I thought she was going to go hard, but she wasn't. But then this went chill, but now it's building up. Okay, this is the real hook. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I think this is gonna end up being one of my favorite VTuber albums. Because right now we got, um, obviously the Suki no Mito album. I, I, if we don't count Midnight Grand Orchestra's album because it's like a, a, a duo thing, then obviously I like both Suisei's albums. The Suisei one's coming out soon. I'm just debating on whether I want to edit it or not. And the intro's kind of got to be edited anyways because I talk about the songs that I didn't react to. But since it, it, there, was only, there was only three songs that I needed to react to because the rest were versions of songs that I already heard. And they didn't change enough to where I felt like the reaction was worth it. So I just listened to all those and then I reacted to the new ones. But I still wanted to make up for that by at least reviewing, quote unquote, and talking about the songs that I didn't, or even though I've reacted to them in the past, but like at least just talking about more in depth maybe what, what, what why I like those songs and adding a little bit more to the video to make it worth it, I guess. I don't know how to put it. So, yeah, and especially see if there was any, um, 
Well, I guess you're gonna have to see the video to find out if I thought there was any good changes or not, or if I just thought that it was just a new version. <laughs> uh, but yeah, still stellar, stellar, obviously. And then Spectre, I liked. Uh, and then Kiara's album was pretty good. And then yeah. Mori would possibly be up there if her most consistent project wasn't. Cause I lied. I thought it was Jigaku Six for the for when I first heard that, but it's actually, what, what's the one with Capsule, Marimero, and all those songs on it? That's probably her most consistent one. But I don't even listen to it that much, outside of uh, one one song. I don't listen to it really much at all, except for one song. First question, is Mori Calliope Japanese or American? She's clearly white. But why is that the question that's being asked? I just searched up Mori Calliope EP. Google, I don't care. Oh, which one? Shinigami No, there it is. Let's see. Capsule, it's all right, but like, it's like, I don't know. I, I like it. It's fine. Eh, there's better songs from both artists. That I could listen to instead. Mary Mary was cool. But what was the song? Makeup? No, it was Let's End the World. I listened to that one a lot. I actually haven't listened to more in a minute, though. That fucking... That tearless burnt me out, man. I don't want to listen to her ever again. Because I listened to her for like a week straight while making that video. It was crazy. That's what I do when I do tearless, though. I go in. Like, I want it to be properly rated. So I want to make sure I'm right. Hello. Hippity hop switch up. <laughs> yeah, this is beautiful, man. Hey! Oh! 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 Little spice! What was that? What the fuck was that? Did you did, 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 did a little bit of fucking? That, this sounded like some Spanish music right there for a second. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> What a bop, man. What a bop. Okay, next. One second. It's pending. I'm looking up the name of the fucking song. Because that is a kanji I don't think I've actually ever fucking seen before in my life. God damn. Let's see. Oh, nice. We got it. It's out of order. Fuck. Okay. This is... Saki Gake? I'm just gonna look it up. Yeah, that's the same kanji. This is Sakiyake. Let's fucking get it. We litty. We litty. Yeah, first song was great. Didn't say much about it, but it's just like... With Toa, it, I find it hard to comment on much because it's like... It's so easy to get sucked in. And a lot of them, I feel, share the same values that make me like it. Where it's like very rich, very... Um, extravagant. You know, a little orchestral, but not... Not insane, especially since a lot of the times they have some sort of drums or electric guitar or something rock-ish. More, I guess, J-rock-ish to 
balance it out so it's not like in your face every single time. And then her voice, I mean, she's bringing out the same deep, beautiful fucking voice that you always hear. So it's like, I, I don't have too much to say that I haven't said before, but I'm just over here enjoying myself because, you know, it's a fucking Monday. I already hate life. Got the whole week ahead of me. Why not enjoy some music? Uh, and, and, and just and it's listen like a fan for once. Do do. What? Okay, guys, do you know what the sound is? I always hear that shit in a lot of J-Rock songs. What is that sound? Am I dumb? Am I supposed to know what that is? Like, is it just smacking a piece of wood with another piece of wood? Like, like is it like that? I don't know. And I'm not even trying to be, like, offensive or nothing. It's, like, actually, like, some cultural shit. Because I just genuinely don't know. Even though I should, because I've literally heard that for years and years in different anime or J-Rock or Japanese songs. And I never even thought about it till now. What the fuck is that sound? Or is it something that I already know and just didn't realize? Let me know. It's an instrument I've never heard of. Look at the hair, bro. Good tempo on this one. Tempo. That's why I got a song. It's a perfect speed. Mm. And this one really does have that aggression. Like she's saying the lyrics, but she's kind of pushing some of the vocals. Not in like a forceful, like this sounds bad type of way, but kind of to where it's louder and uh, more in your face. And I like that. Like she's over pronouncing some things, I feel like. Or emphasizing, overemphasizing. That's what I mean. I know words. Yeah. Oh. My fault. You got it. Yeah. Can we talk about that electric guitar riff? I think it's the electric guitar riff in that sound. I could be fucking wrong. That's so nice. And also, I wanted to mention before she did the... Uh, because I felt like, oh, my bad, bro. My bad, you can take my lunch money. Uh, I wanted to talk about the the art, the album art. I, I do like it. The flowers are very nice. And there was that song, um, fucking uh, uh, San, San, San Natalia, that's literally a flower. So what does Oster mean? Oh, that's a flower! Oh, yeah! Oh my God, the the connections! Oh my goodness, it really is a concept album. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sometimes I thought that was going to be the end. So what else do you have to score? Yeah, I'm a fan of Saki Gante, for sure. Okay. It seems like they're not going to do it, but I'll tell you what I thought was going to happen. Like every other fucking song with it, it's a hard song. And then for the last one, she sings it, and it's just like 
the the strings but no hardness and and then it kicks in for the hook to loop in again but the real hook this time you know every song does that where it does it soft before the final hook and then does it i don't know if i'm explaining myself well but if you listen to enough j music you know what i mean but they didn't do it and they kept going with a hard and they just doubled up the hard version twice or the real version twice and i thought that was a, a good choice keep up the energy <laughs> <laughs> can you tell that I forgot I was gonna record this reaction today? You probably can, cause you see a tired as fuck man. And hey, I've heard Anna Monet uh, before. <gasps> Get out my face, bitch! I've heard you, and I've heard. Wait, no, <laughs> I have not heard you. So, uh, for the next one, we got, uh, 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 uh
Yeah, another solid one for sure. Hell yeah. Okay, next we got Who's Thorns. I don't know. Why are you asking me? Maybe we'll find out. The slow one. I hear the ranch dressing uh, piano. That was supposed to be a joke. Not. I, I kind of lost the joke when I was thinking of it. So I like. I don't. I don't even know what that was supposed to be. So ignore that. Almost turned into a Stenka song for a second. I can't tell the direction this one's going yet. I like the darker energy. Look, I don't know what this song's about necessarily, but I'm sure that's pain in her voice that you're supposed to be hearing, right? Because I can hear it. I loved that. So fire. So fire. You see me closing my eyes. Sorry, it's a habit, man. When I listen to music, if I, like, I feel like I can hear more of the layers when I do this as opposed to this for some reason. And I think I can get away with it. It's not like I gotta look at anything. What am I looking at? I look at the same fucking thing for the last 20 minutes, man. If, if I don't do something, I'm gonna fucking leave because of my, my fidgety ass is just sitting here like, fuck, man. Although I can chill, I'm not always fidgety. I can chill. I can definitely chill. You know, I've been chilling. I actually been chilling this whole time. I, th I think, right? Have you seen my leg do like this a million times? No, we're good. We're good. <laughs> but sometimes, man, I can't fucking sit down. This could definitely be one of my favorites, though. Oh shit! Now I'm way louder than music, but bio. I wonder if someone's home. Hold on. I think humans have arrived. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's keep listening. <laughs> Dude, this has the same exact like slow but hard hitting hook flow that a lot of my favorite kind of rock songs from when I was really young would have just the daunting you know this is definitely one of my favorites Yes, sir. This is really Eddie core right here.
What a nice little ending. All the sounds come back together. Whatever the fuck she was saying at the end there. That was nice. Next we got uh, Ryan May, but we've heard that, so... Oh! Get out of my ears! What's this one? Purple Disease. Um, never mind. I was gonna make, uh, possibly an HIV AIDS joke, but I'm not gonna make it. Because my last joke flopped and I forgot what the fucking joke was before I said it, so... I think we're not allowed to joke for the rest of this uh, video. Deal? Ooh, this is gonna be the mainstream one, right? This is the one I hear on the radio? Hey! Otto, is that you? Oh, this is the rave song, isn't it? You made it just for me, huh? Cool. I showered right before this. I haven't done this in a minute. Ah! Oh! I couldn't even do it! Ah! Oh my god! I'm not finished! I'm finished! I'm finished! Oh my god! Look, guys, this has been sore forever, so I, I was I haven't done this in a few months because I haven't been practicing my dancing. But you know how I, I can do that now, where I can jump over that with one leg? I just try to do it, but I stood on this leg, and this is the one where the good old hip or whatever the fuck this is called is hurting. So I went to do it, and I, I crumbled. I went, ah! So let's try it again. Well, let's try it again. We'll get, you can see, wait, actually, yeah, you can see me holding the foot. We're good, we're good. Ah! Oh, God! Hold on, let's try it again. Whew. Let's try it again. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, whatever. We're not getting it. Uh, uh, uh. Look, man, I literally just went on a run, okay? I literally just went on a run before recording. That's why I showered, you dumbass. So don't blame me for my... Is the... What is this? What is this? I don't want to lift it too high, but like... What's that right there? Can you see how fucking white my upper legs are, man? That is crazy. They're not even as strong as they used to be either. This used to be fucking meaty. Same with my calves. They used to be huge. And now they look like little chicken wings. Little chicken bones, man. It's crazy. It's because I haven't worked out since, like, high school. I just go on runs. And I'm not even, like, a cross-country runner. I'm clearly of a bigger stature than, like, a skinny guy that does, like, track and running and shit. Well, not necessarily track, but, like, you know how runners be. They, they, they like to stay slim. I don't necessarily... I don't want to be slim. I just want to be good, you know? Um... <laughs> so I, I just do it because it's calming to me not necessarily because I want to be like the best runner in the world or nothing but I do need to start working out again because like I look how much I lost bro this used to be huge and now it's like it's this average god damn it's it's even fat it's 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 sad so and I'm not even tan right now bro I look like a white Mexican oh wait I am I am it's not a bad thing, though. You know, I like being Mexican-American. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. I don't know Spanish, though. Do y'all know that? But you know what I am learning? Japanese. Sorry, ancestors. I'm sorry, guys. This is the anime, you know? I'm sorry. Yeah. Me Mexico didn't make no anime. They didn't make no I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They ain't got wife. <laughs> oh, wait. Let me rewind. I don't even... I, I just remembered what we were doing. I won't lie. This might not be my favorite overall, but this might end up being my most listened to because it's such a fucking vibe. Definitely the easiest listen. Unless the lyrics have some underlying sadness, which they may very may well wait, wait very well may. I'm obviously gonna read them all later. I just uh, they're on a reaction like. It's one thing to have English lyrics, but it's another thing to have translated because I'm going back and forth looking at the stuff. It's just not worth it during a reaction. But y'all know I like Toa. I'll peep it after. So when I read them, I'm going to be like, well, fuck, this is a depressing song. <laughs> but for now, we're chilling. Dance, oh, oh, 
Ooh. Oh yeah, this also probably has the best flow in the album in terms of like, well, not many of them have really attempted like a, 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 a crazy flow or nothing, but this one's definitely got the most creative flows, even though it kind of is just like, I don't want to say it's just an auto song because it's not because there's also other things that are kind of unique to it. But like in terms of a comparison for like a Japanese singer that has a good quote unquote rapping flow or at least close to it in terms of speed and delivery um it, it's kind of like that uh i don't know where i was going with that but i i, I like it i don't know what i'm saying <laughs> but, it's like, <laughs> but obviously since her voice i mean auto can reach deep voice too but her voice i feel is way naturally deeper than auto that it, it feels a little bit more natural here. Huh? Although Otto is my favorite Japanese artist, so actually, let me let me. Oh wait, I am in Spotify. Eh, maybe I'll look later. Cause I've been thinking about it. I'm like, is she? Are we gonna bump someone else up? Who was I even thinking about? I, I don't even remember. Was I tripping? Is this was this from like a dream? I feel like who would replace Otto? Oh. Okay, I was thinking about this because the last year or so, I cannot stop listening to Riona. I love her music so fucking much. And then even recently, like, I keep on listening to her. So, I, I don't want to say she's better than Otto, but, like, low-key, if I'm listening to her more often than Otto, as of now, wouldn't she be currently my favorite Japanese artist? Right? Isn't that how that works? Like, I've always been a fan of both of them for a long time. Although, Riona probably longer than Otto. Um, but, uh, even then, it's just, Otto's incredible and kind of, I don't know. Uh, I, just, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, are we only halfway through the fucking album? I've talked so much and we're only halfway through the album. We only have one, two, three more songs, so we can get through it. We can get through it. I was thinking of recording in two parts, but we don't need to do that. We're almost done. Oh, it's, look at this is the thing I was talking about. The other song. This is the thing I was talking about. The other song where they sing it lightly and then it kicks in again, and, boom, 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 and it's harder again. But in this song, it works. It's a party song. Come on. Now. Ah! I'm sorry, I thought something was falling on me, but it was just <laughs> okay for context, right? Oh, uh, you can't even see it, but this kind of door at the top, you can't see it, but there's this little black thing. Oh, it's you, like, you see that, but from my point of view, staring up, I thought that was like an object falling from the top, and I got scared as fuck, and I was like, oh. <laughs> Ignore me. I'm making new white girl dances. I don't have room right now. There's a lot of shit in my room that's not normally in here. I won't lie, couldn't it be my fucking favorite? Although I really liked, um, what was the last one I reacted to actually? Let me check. I might be mixing them up because I did react to three, three days in a row. It might've been, uh, hold on. Hold on, did I record them out of order? Oh, it's not out yet as of time of recording this, but it will be. Wait, is it not? Hold on. Is it not? 
Oh, it is. Okay. I just had a refresh because it's from last night. Uh, <laughs> San Vitalia. Um, that one was really good too. Anamone is pretty good as well. Um, although I kind of held off on adding it to the playlist until I added the whole album to the playlist because I, I, it's a pet peeve of mine having like, you know, so I haven't listened to it too much since I first heard it, but I, I've heard it a few times still because I do like it. Um, Twilight was good and Rayman Ray was, Ray May was fine as well, but like Purple Disease definitely stands out. Um, for better or worse, I mean, if you don't like this type of music, then maybe for worse, but for me, I, I love this type of shit as well, so. I can see myself listening to that so much. And we've heard the next one, so we're gonna skip that. Only got three songs left. Hold on, goddamn. Antares. Now, why did I think that that came out before? Yeah, it's, it's, it's new. Feature guest from nine agencies? Now, how in the fuck was I supposed to know that? Guest Hoshimachi Suise? I'm in. Bales? I don't know the rest of them? Now, how the fuck? Wait, are they in the song? Or, like, am I, am I just. Like, what? There's no lyrics or nothing. Oh, fuck. Look, guys, I'm not gonna know when anyone. If, they, if they're all in this song, like, singing. I'm not going to know when any of them are in it outside of maybe Sui Say. Like, I'm legitimately going to be... I'm out of no fucking clue. But, like, Reddit doesn't lie. So, I have to trust Reddit, right? I'm so confused now. Fuck, I'm going to hear random voices that I don't know. Bales and Toa, I did confuse their voices at one time though, but now that I listen to more Toa, I don't think that'll ever happen again. I do feel bad about it. Like, you guys don't realize how fucking red my face was after I recorded that reaction with them, and I didn't know who was who, and I, I oh my god, I felt, oh, okay, they're all doing vocals for the chorus, allegedly. This is before the album came out, what I'm reading, so, you not even, you never know, um, which is cool, and less confusing. Alright, let's, uh, let's get it. Antares. Oh, classic! Sounds like the beginning of an Eve song! But I'm just gonna assume that might have been Suisi in the background there. It could have been someone. I feel like the background vocals are what they're doing, and then maybe the hook as well. But it could also have just been Toa. Like I said, I'm not gonna catch it. There's no fucking way, no fucking shot, especially with artists that I don't know. <laughs> Reddit's a fucking liars. I'm hearing the chorus right now. It's just Toa. They're definitely the background vocals, though. Mm. Yeah! Oh, okay. This isn't a background vocal. It's a main vocal. But ah, just shut the fuck up. I hear a dude in there, or maybe a really deep voice girl. That was cool though. I, 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 all, all memes aside, I did enjoy that. Let's reload it. It is kind of cute, isn't it? I'm gonna really like this one too. Well, this is wholesome. 
in between ears boom boom it's kind of nice hey the guest focus are bringing life to it hey my god to do Sweet. This is another favorite for sure. I love this one. This could be my favorite of the album, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie! What a fucking sweet song, man. I really like that. That was nice. Very nice. Next we got Cry Out, and then we're gonna close it off with uh, one more song after that. Can you tell me how I am now? Can you hear, can you see my eyes? So let you add the game if we want to. No EDM. Hold on, I'm just looking at something because the name of the last song is throwing me off. Oh wait, no, 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 no. never mind. No, I was, okay, so I was looking at this and I was like, what the fuck is that? But it's not even that one, is it? It's not that one. It's this one. Makes fucking sense, cause uh, the fucking the 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 kanji, uh, you know, for 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 ni and, and and shit is there. So I was like, okay. I'm so stupid. I don't know why I was trusting fucking whatever the fuck that said. Oster Tartarisus. I fucking thought that's in Tartarus. I was like, this is one of that flower pop up in Tartarus, bro. I played P3. Come on now. Come on now. So it's it's ni Ninin Sankaku, but who does a feature? It said it has a feature. Nekotasuna. Who the hell? I don't think I know them. The VTuber. Gotcha. And her titties are out. So, I mean, I'm not complaining. What the fuck is a Vispo? Esports! Wow. So, so they're degenerate. <laughs> wow. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. Well, let's keep going. Sorry for that. I do feel bad. Weird 
mix. It sounds like she's venting some frustration, but then it sounds like a banger as well. The song is called Cry Out, so... Maybe that's what helps with it. Everyone! Cry those fucking tears! I'm a fucking DJ. That's cool. pretty cool. I will admit my favorite part is like the drop and the little thing that I messed around with the vocals earlier but it's still all well pretty good. up next is twilight oh i'm dumb for some reason i thought that wasn't there but we we heard twilight already come on now all right so this is uh wait wait shut the fuck up oh my goodness bro do you want all the fucking attention what do you think this is about you uh, it is <laughs> yeah it is uh this one is not uh oster tartarus oh, oh, which one is this this is fucking nining san kyaku featuring Well, I don't think it's this Misono song from 2008. Um, why are there so many songs called this, bro? Jesus fucking Christ, man. I'm just gonna switch the pillow. Featuring Neko Tasuna! <laughs> God damn. Let's get it. This isn't a cover of the other one or anything, is it? I don't think it is. Never mind. There's no way. Because the other one's a different time. The other one's got to be... Hold on. Let me make sure. It'd be very awkward if it was. No, this one's longer. We're good. We're good. Sorry. I was getting a little nervous. You know how weird I am about listening to covers first. Let's go! Tell us making the sleep music playlist. Oh my god. If y'all don't know about it, oh let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Ignore Kobe's face. Ignore Kobe's face. Let me change my fucking account real quick. To John's. Cause that's where I watch on my YouTube. To John's, because that's where I watch on my YouTube. And then I show you the music I listen to when I go to sleep. And I think let's fucking make it. Let me fucking pull this shit up. Let me fucking pull uh, this shit up. 
If you see this shit, you'll know what I'm talking about. It's so obvious. You see what I'm talking about. Like, a song like this, man. I'll show you a few examples. Ugh, shit in my face. If this shit ever wants to load, you feel... Like, these are the type of songs that I listen to when I sleep. All sad Japanese songs. Almost all of them. Or, like, at least chill. And, like, piano and shit like that. God damn, YouTube. Can, can you let me see an example? I'll, I'm gonna turn you down to 144 for once. I just want to hear the fucking song. I don't want to see the video. Damn, premium HD. I don't even need that shit, bro. God damn. You think I need that shit? For real? You think I'm like that? God damn. You know? Okay, but wait, wait, wait. We also got, you know... We, we got Hello. We got little-ass 30-minute playlists and shit. Songs like that. Maybe it'll load this time. Even at 240, it's struggling. Let's turn that to 144. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Eh, eh. This is one of my favorite ones, by the way. Let's see, what's another good one? What's another good one? I got a lot of them. They're, a lot of them are just long ass playlists. But like, this this can make this can make the playlist. The, don't ask me why I'm watching an old episode of The Starters. I felt like I watched some Kobe shit. And The Starters used to be my favorite NBA TV show. So, I, I, you know, a little bit of nostalgia wave. Okay, damn. Damn. Is that allowed? No, it's not. Fuck. Wrong too. I think that's the other girl. <laughs> I like nice duets though, for sure. Yeah! Nice start. This is my type of song. I'm sure the lyrics are sweet too. Ah! Right here. Oh. Nothing like a good duet. Oh, I love this shit, bro. So Eddie Cora. It's my new term for songs that like are just made for me. They sound so nice together.
Yo, I can't keep myself together. I don't know what to do in moments like this. Yo, y'all don't realize it, but there is a market <laughs> for me for these types of songs. I listen to these types of songs so much. Y'all heard me. I listen to these types of songs to go to sleep. And it always takes me forever to fucking fall asleep. So I listen to these types of songs a lot. Or even if I'm just laying down or doing nothing, I like to play this stuff as background music sometimes. Or sometimes I get on my feels and I just want to listen to some shit like that. Sometimes when I'm writing sad parts of my stories and shit, maybe, maybe something wrong. Or just sometimes in general, I just want to listen to that shit. I listen to this shit so much, other genres will be put to shame. God damn it. But I don't really like to react to songs like this. Get from God. <laughs> I almost said I almost said a gift from Jaw, a fucking meme from like when I was like 16. I don't know why. That, ooh, I don't know which one of my favorite is, man. I don't know which one of my favorite is. It's definitely one of the three that I hearted today. It's definitely one of the three that I hearted today. Oh my god. I already thought it was going to be a good album, but that delivered. That fucking delivered. Hey, Sodachi. Wow, man. Wow. Shout out to Toba. Love the album, for sure. Definitely happy with that one. Uh, because I was already pissed off low-key going into it because I forgot that I had to record this today because it was in my schedule. Um, and then I realized, oh shit, because I wanted to record a lot of videos today. Now I'm probably not going to record as much because I've already recorded an hour. <laughs> but it's okay because it was fucking good. So I'm not mad. I'm actually quite happy because I can listen to this tomorrow at work now, especially that last song. <laughs> so good. Hey, man, if y'all are new, though, since if y'all stayed this far... Do me a favor, man. Do me what? I almost burped. One small solid. If you want to see, like, if you happen to like anime, right? I know a lot of y'all do. There's no fucking way you like VTubers and don't like anime. Or some of y'all, at least. My anime channel, Eddie Hates Anime, is almost a 2.5k subscribers. 2,500. And I'm still making videos. You know, I put one out four days ago. One put out 11 day, uh, hours ago. Uh, not days ago. I'm, I was kind of struggling, but I used to put out videos a lot, and I'm going to start putting out videos a lot again. So, you know, we're out here. So, subscribe, please. And then my second channel, I up, I try to upload every single day, as you can see. And it's just kind of miscellaneous. You know, I do games. I fucking upload karaoke, VR videos, tier lists, fucking my podcast, you know, other shit like that. Just a lot of random shit goes on this channel. Anything that's not anime or reactions. So, I'll subscribe to Eddie Hates Everything. And now I'm done self-promoting. Thank y'all for watching. Shout out to Toa, as always. And I, yeah, I just hope you guys have a wonderful fucking day, man. Thanks for watching the whole video. Because I wouldn't watch an hour of me. I'm just saying. It's 59 minutes. What you got what I mean? Peace out. I'm going to go record this Bale's Idol reaction. And bye. Peace.